Typhons was served this is our gay phone 360 reader. It's time to talk about the best tips to fix WhatsApp picture in picture mode not working on iPhone. Times when I want to enjoy WhatsApp video call with my loved ones without putting the ongoing work on the back burner, the picture in picture mode comes into play. In most cases, the PIP mode works like a charm, allowing you to carry out other tasks like writing a note or browsing the web without any hindrance. However, the PIP mode has had its fair share of problems, but both or not, I have found out some workable tips to fix the problem. That said, let's dive right in. First off, I would suggest you to force quit WhatsApp on your iPhone. Do not underestimate it as it has been very impactful in fixing app-related issues like this one. On iPhone with Face ID, you have to swipe up from the home bar and then hold along the middle of the screen to bring up the app switcher. After that, swipe up the WhatsApp card to kill the app. And on your iPhone with Touch ID, you have to double press the home button to bring up the app switcher and then you have to swipe up the app card to force kill the app. Next up, I will suggest you to update WhatsApp on your iPhone. If you haven't updated WhatsApp for a long time, I suspect the devil could very well be inside the outdated version of the messaging app. Since outdated software tends to trigger a hell lot of issues including the out of the blue crashing and freezing, it won't be wrong to put the sole blame on a hidden bug. On your iPhone, launch the App Store. Then tap on your profile at the top right corner of the screen. Now scroll down to find WhatsApp and then hit the update button right next to it and you are good to go. Once you have updated WhatsApp on your iPhone, start a video call to check if you have sorted out the problem. Next up, I will suggest you to force restart your iPhone. If you have been using iPhone for quite some time, you may already be familiar with how effective hard reset like a force restart or force reset is. So we will try it out as well. On your iPhone 8 or later, you have to press and quickly release the volume up button. Then you have to press and quickly release the volume down button. After that, you have to hold down the side button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And on your iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, you have to hold down the side button and the volume down button simultaneously until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And on your iPhone 6s or earlier, you have to hold down the home button and the side button or the top button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. After that, I would suggest you to disable WhatsApp screen lock. For enhanced privacy and also to prevent anyone from bumping into your private messages, WhatsApp lets you lock the app with Face ID and Touch ID. While it works like a charm in offering an additional layer of shield, at times it does tend to block PIP mode from working properly. Hence, I would suggest you to disable it. On your iPhone, open the WhatsApp. Then tap on the settings icon at the bottom. Then select Privacy. Then tap on Screen Lock and finally turn off the toggle for Require Face ID or Touch ID. Next up, I will suggest you to disable and enable the Picture in Picture Mode. Many a time you can troubleshoot WhatsApp's Picture in Picture Mode issue by just turning off and on the system wide PIP mode. Since it has done the trick for me on a few occasions, I can vouch for its viability. To do so, head over to the Settings app on your iPhone, then tap on General. After that, tap on Picture in Picture Mode, and then turn off the toggle. Next, restart your iPhone. Once your device has rebooted, head back into the same setting, and then turn on the toggle for Pit Mode. Now, open WhatsApp, and then start a video call to check if you have sorted out the issue. If you have, then you are good to go. And finally, I would suggest you to update your iPhone. It's always recommended to keep the software updated in order to not only keep miscellaneous bugs at bay, but also enhance the overall performance of your device. So go for it. To do so, open the Settings app on your iPhone, then tap on General. After that, tap on Software Update 
and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS and that's pretty much it. Hopefully you have gotten the beta of the issue and WhatsApp picture in picture mode has started to work as usual. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye bye.